Well, tornado season started early this year. A string of devastating storms ripped across the Midwest in early February, leaving more than 50 dead. Now, such destruction is all too common, yet it is something some home builders believe could be avoided with sturdier construction. As our Hannah Wright explains, concrete homes could be the wave of the future. While the materials may be light as a feather, once they're put together, they're hard as a rock. Green block here, right? There. Richard Oglesby is the general manager of Oklahoma Insulated Concrete Forms, a new company that is trying to change the way we build homes in the state. Basically, they're one by four block, and they're in a, a foot wide, and you stack them up like Legos, and you put rebar inside for reinforcement, and you fill them with concrete, and you have a strong, sturdy concrete outside structure, outside wall of your home. They may look like a child's toy, but there's nothing elementary about the benefit. Homeowners just love it, especially the a lot of the wives. The men, of course, they love the structure. It's a, you know, you're in a concrete fortress almost. Um, they love the energy bills because their heating and cooling costs go way down. They love their tax savings from the Energy Efficiency Act of 2005. They love their insurance savings because you have a fire resistant home. It gets the same rating as a commercial building. Wives love it or mothers love it because it's a quiet home. And builders can benefit from insulated concrete forms as well. Dwayne Holloway is territory manager of Green Block Worldwide, a company that has been manufacturing ICF for more than 40 years. You can do this much faster than you can a conventional method because you're cutting out some of the, of the processes that you have to do. They're just a little different. As times change, so has the building industry. Tulsa Technology Center is now teaching ICF building in their courses. The students are being trained with the curriculum that Oklahoma ICF is providing to the technology centers. So they're learning here and then they're taking to the outside world. Now we'll have trained crews. Now we can bring down the cost. Now we have people that understand that we can whip these homes together a lot faster and move forward. And our goal is to drive down the cost so everybody can afford to live in an energy efficient, safe home. Make sure that that's nice and straight here. And that Howard Smith is the carpentry right. instructor for Tulsa Technology welcome. Center and says so by taking his course, students get hands-on experience with cutting-edge technology. Getting the students out there where they're trained in this field is so important because uh, when, if we can get some contractors to start in with this, they'll have an, a labor force that they can choose from by coming to Tulsa Tech and hiring our students because we are training them in the most innovative ways of the, today's building. And student Kyle Tribble says building with ICF blocks is much easier than with conventional wood framing. Well, it takes a lot less tools and takes pretty much all you need is really a saw, maybe a hammer and some nails, but when you got a red wood framing, you got to use screwdrivers, nails, saws, table saws, pretty much everything you could use. That's everything that's a shop. Learning the latest that's methods and preparing tomorrow's builders for the future. This will be everywhere and I'm going to use it in my house when I grow up.